Hi, this is Fred with Finale Inventory. Today I'm going to show you how to do a batch stock transfer using Finale Inventory. So first, let's take a look at our stock. You see we have three products. We're going to move all of these three products. You can see these are the quantities that we have and they're currently in sublocation Columbia. So let's go to our home screen and we're going to go to stock transfers. Here we're going to choose batch stock transfer and we're going to add a new batch stock transfer shipment. First we need to choose the origin so it's going to be moving from Columbia and we're going to be moving it to the Germany warehouse and if you'd like you can choose carrier, inner tracking information, the estimated ship date, the estimated receive date. The carrier is user defined in your application settings. So now let's enter quantities. So let's choose 35 of this product 40 of this product, 20 of this product. And now we need to choose the actual destination sublocation. So let's double click here and let's choose Germany. Same thing for this one and again for this one. So you can see we're moving 35, 40, and 20 units respectively all to the Germany destination. So now we're going to save now. If you like, you can print documents. And now we're going to ship the shipment. And click Ship the Shipment. At this point, the inventory is considered in transit. So it's no longer available in Colombia, but it's not yet available in the Germany warehouse. And if we go to our stock view, you can see we have the units considered in transit right here. If you don't have this column on your screen, you can always go to Actions and customize this screen to choose that as a viewable column. Now once the inventory arrives at the destination warehouse, we can go back into our transfers, go to Batch Stock, and now we're going to choose that shipment. We click Receive the Shipment, enter the date, Receive Shipment, and now when we go to our stock levels, you can see the inventory has been moved. So Finale by default shows you the sum of all your products. You can expand any line detail to see the breakdown. Right, we have 15 in Colombia, 35 in Germany. We can also use the location filters to show only stock levels at Columbia Warehouse or only stock levels at the Germany Warehouse. That's how you do a batch stock transfer using Finale Inventory. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us at service at finaleinventory.com. Thank you.